The day that I had my double mastectomy, I woke up in a haze in the hospital and my breast surgeon walked into the room with an update of what happened during surgery. He let me know that he biopsied 15 lymph nodes and from the pathology report, two lymph nodes came back with microscopic cancer. I sunk in my hospital bed like, oh no, what does this mean? And he said, well, most likely you'll be having a port installed in the next two weeks and starting your chemotherapy. And I was horrified. I looked to my husband and said, if I have to do chemotherapy, I think I'm going to run away. And how do I know? How do I know if that's truly the right answer that I have to do chemotherapy? And Fortunately, I had Dr. J. Harness to turn to with breast cancer answers, and he said, It used to be that if a patient had even one lymph node positive, they automatically got chemotherapy. But fortunately, we've moved away from one size fits all into an era of personalized breast cancer care. I felt strongly that it was important for Wendy to have the Oncotype DX test in order to determine what the odds were of her cancer coming back over the next 10 years, as well as whether she would benefit from chemotherapy or not. It was really important that Wendy and her physicians have the best information available in order to make the right decision for her. And the best news was that my medical oncologist agreed with Dr. Harness that I should not hurry and have a port installed and start chemotherapy, but that I should take the Oncotype DX test. And when my results came back, my specific breast cancer showed that it had a low recurrence score, which meant that I would not benefit from chemotherapy. I was so relieved. I was overjoyed that I can focus on getting back to my health and healing, get my stamina back, not have to lose my hair or run away because of what I thought could have happened. That feeling, that feeling of confidence that the test provided, there's nothing like it.